everyone, it's Colleen with DietsInterview.com and this is your Biggest Loser, Episode 16 Recap. The contestants met up with Editor-in-Chief from Good Housekeeping Magazine to get their knowledge tested on fitness and food trivia. The person with the most correct answers won themselves a three-day trip to New York City. A great prize to have after this is all said and done because everyone has worked so hard. The quiz was based off of calorie knowledge, serving size, and all the things that come with being healthy. It came down to a tiebreaker between Kristen and Mike. It was based off the calorie content of a fast food fish sandwich. Mike won the tiebreaker by guessing five calories away from the actual calorie content of the sandwich. Congratulations to him as he enjoys three days in New York City. This week's challenge was classified as one of the most terrifying challenges yet on The Biggest Loser. The contestants were in cages, suspended 45 feet in the air, and it was up to them to keep themselves up there. It was an upper body challenge where they had to hang onto a rope and keep themselves suspended. As the contestants began to fall one by one, it came down to Tara and Helen holding on for dear life and holding on to win the prize. This week's challenge prize was either $10,000 cash or a one pound advantage at this week's weigh-in. Getting so close to the end of the game, a one pound advantage is something that everybody always chooses. But in this scenario, Tara won the challenge and won herself $10,000. She opted for the cash. Can you believe it this far in the game? She was totally confident in herself going into this week's weigh-in and she was fine. She lost five pounds and didn't even need that one pound advantage. So now she lost five pounds and is $10,000 richer, so congratulations, Tara. As for Helen and Kristen, they fell below the yellow line this week, putting themselves up for elimination. Due to a tie in the elimination room, the contestants ended up sending Kristen home because of the lowest percentage of weight loss. Kristen, since being home, is doing fantastic. She's speaking in front of people, inspiring everyone around her, and truly believing in herself. Kristen hopes to be to her goal of 200 pounds, by this year's finale. For DietsInterview.com, I'm Colleen, and I'll see you all next week.